doing good i'm your host jason in this video i will be showing you how to build a video editor profile on wix once on wix.com you can create an account for completely free all you will need is your email and that's it you don't need a credit card or anything like that to sign up once you have signed up i want you to tap on create on wix editor after selecting create on wix editor you will be redirected to this page and we are going to tap on set up without AI. After selecting set up without AI, all you will need to do now on the search bar you are going to simply type in video editor. So you can do that real quick so you can see right there and we could type in video editor profile. After doing that you are going to tap on continue. Once you have tapped on continue, you can see that Wix is preparing our dashboard in the background. Once our dashboard has been prepared, you'll be able to name your website and also you'll get access to other editing options. So we can enter our name for our website right here. So I'm just going to call it test editor. So let me do that real quick. Then we're going to tap on continue. After tapping on continue, you can see the different apps that they recommend that we install onto our website. So first, the portfolio app has already been added and you can also see the video app has been added, which will allow us to share, stream and sell our videos. If you would like to also add blogs, you could do that. If it is a case that you like to stream and sell music, you can also do that. And if you would like to set up bookings, you can do that also by selecting booking. If you have an online course that you like to create and sell, you can tap on online store and you could start doing that. You could start selling online. You could also create your course by selecting online programs right there. Once you're finished, you're going to tap on continue in the bottom right hand corner. After doing that, I want you to tap on go to dashboard. Once you have selected go to dashboard, you'll be redirected to your Wix dashboard. And this is how your dashboard looks. The first thing we're going to be doing is going over to the left hand menu option and we're going to set up our portfolio. So you're going to tap on portfolio right here and you can see some sample projects that Wix has added. Now to add a project, all you'll need to do is you can tap on add a project right here or you can tap on add a project in the top right hand corner. After you have done that, you can give your project a name. Then from here, you can enter a description if you want. Then you can choose your project type, date and also location. So let's say for example, I were to type in portraits. Then you can choose a date right there. So let's say for example, April 2024. Then you can choose a location right here. So I'll choose a random location. Let's say for example, New York. After doing that, you're going to tap on next. Then from here, you'll be able to upload your first project. So you could tap on upload media from computer and you could upload your first project right there. Once you're finished, you'll tap on done and then you can choose to add another project if you want. You can also delete the sample projects by simply tapping right here on the box to select all projects. Then you'll unselect your project. After you have done that, you will see the option delete selected or you can choose to hide them. After doing that, you can also create collections by going over to the left hand menu option. You could tap on collection right there and you could create a new collection if you want. After doing that, you can tap on video library from the left hand menu option. And from here, you'll be able to add your videos. So you can choose to upload videos from your computer or your Dropbox or Google Drive. Or you can choose to paste in your video URL. If for example, you have a YouTube channel and you like to paste it in. Also in the future, if you would like to create a blog, you can do that by selecting blog right here. You could select posts and from there you will be able to create your own or your first blog post. Another thing that you can also do is by tapping on getting paid from the top left hand corner. From here you can connect different payment methods. So you could tap on connect payment methods 
and depending on the country you're located in you'll see different payment options that you can connect so you can connect your paypal or stripe account or so on once you're finished i want you to tap on set up in the top right top left hand corner better yet after tapping on set up you're going to tap on design site in the top right hand corner once you have done that you'll be redirected to this page and we're going to tap on pick a template after selecting pick a template you'll be redirected to here on which you can choose from one of the numerous templates that wix provides you with so i'm going to be selecting this one so i'll quickly tap on edit after tapping on edit you're going to give it a few seconds while wix sets up our website in the background once our website has been set up i will be showing you how to edit it and so on as it is quite straightforward and easy to use wix once here you can choose to either type in some information right here then tap on generate site text and allow the wix ai to put content on your website or you can simply close the pop-up then tap on the plus 50 percent in the top right hand corner and at the moment this is how our website looks right here and you can see that it does look stunning now to start editing it for example let's say we would like to change the name right here you can simply tap on any section that you would like to edit then tap on edit text or you can tap on quick edit and from there you can change the text so for example if i wanted to change the text i can simply type in right there my name and you can see it right there so let me do that real quick so i can type in my name right there you can see it right there and any other changes you would like to make all you have to do is select the section then from there you can choose to for example if you would like to change this video you could tap on manage videos after selecting the section and then from there you could choose another video Another thing that you can also do when it comes on to Wix, if it is a case that you would like to add something that you don't see on your website. So let's say, for example, you would like to add something to this section. You can go over to the top left hand corner and tap on add elements. By tapping on add elements, you can see all the elements that are available to you. So, for example, you can add images, buttons, strip, decoration, pop ups anything at all that you like to add to your website you can find it in this section and another thing also to view all the pages on your website you are going to select home in the top left hand corner from there you can see all the pages so if we were to select the portfolio page we'll be redirected to our portfolio page and you can see it right here this is the sample portfolio that i have created and these are the preloaded ones so you can see how it looks right there once everything is to your liking you can tap on preview in the top right hand corner to preview how it looks and also if it is okay to you you can tap on publish for it to go live and that's it hope you found this tutorial helpful and informative if you did be sure to hit the like button and subscribe